Hi guys, I'm Antonio, and in uh, this video I will show you how to get the uh, screen dimensions. So first, let's create a new class in our package. We'll name the class screen dimension. So screen dimensions. Click finish. Extends activity. Set on create method. Let's make a, a layout file. create other XML layout name it screen dimension dimension screen dimensions we need a linear layout ok click finish ok here it is we leave it as it is let's go to the manifest to set the activity here is the manifest we have the activities here we will copy this one and we will paste it below ok and we will change here the name of the activity in the manifest to screen dimensions so I think we are ok let's delete the filter, we don't need the filter for in this case save and close the Android manifest ok let's close and the XML and we are back in uh, screen dimensions now we have to go to menu and change the first uh, the second item from class to the new class which is screen dimensions oh, we have to n in dimension sorry we have to use to m here save it and we have to do the same into the Android manifest and here is the item that will appear in the menu so screen dimensions ok with to n that's the mistake we done let's go back to to manifest and fix the name here with twin close the manifest and we can go back in screen dimensions java and now we have set content Control space enter r dot layout enter dot screen dimensions xml and close with a semicolon now we're gonna make two methods let's do the first one first name it get uh, screen info with metrics display metrics, let's try metrics open close parenthesis question mark and now we can make create method ok, click to create the method and here we are here we will put the code to get the screen information first we want to to set the uh, display metrics a variable display metrics name it m and this it will be equal with uh, new display metrics we make an instant for the class we have to import if you have any problem we have to use the class name our class name screen we have to use the method get windows manager which uh, retrieve the window manager for showing in, for showing custom windows then we need the method get default display which is uh, the display upon which the this window manager instance will create uh, new windows and then we want the get metrics method 
which uh, display the metrics that uh, describe it, describe the size and density of uh, this uh, display. As you see it here, the size is adjusted based on the current rotation of the display. You can uh, read all this to see what uh, the get metric uh, metric method does. So let's click it, and we use the M as we set it. Now we need variables. First, let's uh, create an, an int, and we'll name it uh, height, and this will be equal with uh, M dot. Uh, and here you can see all the information that we that we can have for our screen who comes with uh, display metrics and this is all the methods that we have so we want to have the height in pixels as you see here it returns an int value double click it close it with the semicolon and that's it same way you can use the width let's try another one let's get the density yes this is a float we need a float variable and uh, now in the same way we can uh, get any other information that we that we want and now let's let's create a string to put all the information inside so we can uh, see it with the toast uh, we can set uh, the density but you can do it at your own if you want let's close the string here and put it in the toast okay what we have done here we set the variable m instance of uh, display metrics object class and then we get the screen dimension for the for this activity screen dimension this a windows manager who retrieve the window manager for uh, showing custom windows then we set the get default display which uh, returns the display upon which the windows manager instant will uh, create new windows and finally we get uh, with the get metrics m who gets the display metrics that uh, describe the size and the density of uh, this uh, display and as you see here the size is adjusted based on the current rotation of the display and here it says that uh, the size returned by this method does not necessarily represents the actual row size native uh, resolution of uh, the display return size may adjust it to execute certain system decor elements that are always visible may also be scaled to provide compatibi compatibility with older application were originally designed for smaller displays so if you don't understand something you can read why we, had, we have done this uh, method and uh, then in height we get the height pic in pixels with pixels and the density in uh, pixels in float uh, value we set the string and we put the string to a toast we forgot to show the toast Double click it and we're okay. Let's run it. So, this is the menu screen dimensions. Click on this, and we can see here the height and the width. That's it for this lesson. Thank you, guys.